Kim Engel practice here. It's I not know. every single day you have to have a snarlet like that, you yeah. know, sitting next to you on a chair. I've, I've, I've like looked after her for so many years. And you all Belharians, were you saying? Yes, yeah. we're from the same area. It's like Zone yes. 2 extension, what what? Hmm, something like that one. <laughs> <laughs> now, now Kim is of course making it big both locally and internationally, starring in Dominion, but she's quite active on the sporting field as well. I mean, we can all see she looks fantastic mm. and apparently does her own stunts too. Tell is us a little bit though? more about, is, is, is this true? Do you do your own stunts and how do you keep your body and your physique as tip-top as it is? Well, I think stunt work is all part of acting, so I do, I mean, I've trained with swords, I've trained with weapons, yeah. I've done a bit of combat fighting, yeah. so obviously you just kind of like ready yourself for anything. Unless you're Liam Neeson in Taken 3 and yeah. then you can see someone yeah. else is doing it. Yeah. So wait, what's, what's the wickedest stunt you've ever had to do, like afterwards you felt like, wow. I nearly could have just broken a few bones there, um, but it was so good. I think I did like a, a half like roundhouse kick once. What? Yeah, like a really low like roundhouse kick. So yeah. that was one of it wasn't on Dominion on another on another form. Yes. But but uh, can you well I would I, you just, be able to I wish demonstrate we could clear. that how, how you would do that or <laughs> would you need to like warm up first? And I think I started with like a forward roll onto a little, little base plate and then got on there and then did a oh, like a the works. And then really low like round up. Did the guy have to go, oh it was a girl actually. Oh, and, and she did, yeah. She helped me and made me look good another the sunplay. Yeah. But how do you manage to, to keep yourself in, in the physical condition that you need yeah. to, to do all these hectic stunts? I think the basis of any kind of fighting, um, for me, has been boxing. Yeah. You know, just keeping shoulders up and, you know, and just really being really fit, because I think that kind of teaches yeah. you that. True. Um, I do a lot of core work. Yeah. Um, I play a bit of golf. Um, I do a lot of plyometrics, so just quick movements rather than long endurance yeah. things. Yeah. Well, that's golf, a, I know, a golf is a thing. I need to get into that. I know plays. So I, I played with Ilana before, yeah. she's good. Now, talking about golfing, you've started a women's clinic called Wonder Women. Tell yes. us more about that. Um, basically, it's a ladies' golf clinic, and it teaches ladies about the different, um, the, the different uh, basic phases of, of golf, in okay. terms of, like, you on a putting green, you... Oh, you, <laughs> you know, getting yourself out of the sand yeah. or just those basic things. And um, I host it and I run it with different golf pros. And yeah. I started out in Johannesburg at the Wanderers, yeah. there for the name Wonder Women. Mm -hmm. But it's also women feel intimidated on a golf course when they're yeah. just starting out. I mean, we look really great on a golf course, but yeah. <laughs> just that initial like True. first tee off or yeah. ninth tee off, it's usually like right next to the the lunch area okay. and if you have all these men who are really good at golf yeah. staring hey. at you and you have Pressure. this performance anxiety. But, but for dudes as well, it's very intimidating. Teeing off the first one of the morning, especially for the first person heading off, it, it is very intimidating. But why why golf though? Is that um, Because it's something, something that, that you, I like. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. something that I like. I felt intimidated on a, on a golf course um, and I really want to do well like most females yeah. are, you know. We want to start something and do really good at it. Yes. So. Um, so that's why I started it. That's cool. I was, I was thinking there might have been social, a potential. It's social as well. Yeah. But now you've got me interested. How can like a novice like me get involved or anyone that's watching? How can we get well, involved? I, I do different events. I've done about three of them in Johannesburg. Okay. Maybe I can bring it to Cape Town depending on the to. demand. I'm sure okay, there's demand. After today, there's we'll demand. Be, <laughs> the website is on your screen right now. Yeah. Yeah, and then I'll just, just I'll just use my Twitter feed to let yeah. people know about when the next one is. Awesome Fantastic. stuff. Well, you know what we do have in Cape Town right, right now is some really sexy men outside. <laughs> Graham, I'm not talking about you, but. <laughs>